YouTube. So today it's my first Minecraft video. Let's get some water on and let's start. Being pretty quiet because my mum is actually still asleep right now. So this is my first Minecraft video considering I've been playing Roblox too much. So guys, this channel might not consist of Fortnite. So if you're into Fortnite, maybe don't come on this channel. So we're going to try survival. Survival. Easy. Let's call it. Is it let me click? We'll just call it YouTube. So I won't use cheats unless needed. We'll also show coordinates. If this is helping any of you, good. That was already shown. This is the start of the world. Ow. So also, this is going to be kind of like a tutorial on Minecraft if you really need. So, the first step to Minecraft is gathering wood. then when you've got all your wood oh look we got an ice biome over here now next step go to your crafting menu now if joel joins that might be fine he usually joins me a lot see if joel joins don't worry the filter So you do make some mistakes like I'm doing right now. Just be careful on the animals because there could be a wolf around trying to trying to protect its food. Or we'll say. So get a sword and get a pickaxe. Those are the best two to start with. And if I'm honest. I would start in a cave because you never know what resources you'll find. Also, I need a bunch of sheep. So usually sheep are kind of hard to find. So if I see a wolf, don't kill any sheep or cow. Sorry if it's pretty poor quality, guys. It's my. I don't have an, a way to record it on my Switch screen. So if you hear any growling, that's because there's wolves. A village! Right, guys, who. Because I've seen a village, I'm not gonna start in a village. I'll just. Li I might. live near the village or something. I should forget it. I'm going to live in the village, but eventually I'll move on. Next step is food. You should kill, you should always kill some animals so you can get some food. Or, go to the villagers place and dig up all their crop. You don't want these. And because of the farmers, they're very good at working, they're always going to plant some more. Oh. I could tame this horse, 
but I don't have a saddle. The only way to get saddles is pretty much dungeon chest. So you don't have to use a stick to get all these if you don't want to. I'm just going to take this barrel to see how it's. So for now, I will live in a village. Watch out, there's, iron go there's an iron golem on the loose. I'll choose this house to live in too. We just need to clean it up a little bit. Hey, sorry, Rosa. Wait, are you using that? Are you using that for this? A stonemason. Sorry, stonemason. So my friend, this is my house now. Dead. Because this is now my house, I'm gonna go get some trees. I'm actually off to go attempt beating the iron golem. Just to note, y'all, iron golems are pretty strong. So all I need to do is come in here, respawn, respawn point set. Now where's that stupid golem? Sorry guys, my game's a bit laggy. Golem fight. It's gonna be hard to beat a golem with a wooden sword, so I'd recommend healing before you go swinging again. We see here iron golems are not very fast. But I think when you hit a golem, the faster it goes. So yeah, as you see guys, I, I didn't put keep inventory on. So that's one. Let's just Okay, I'm sorry for attacking you, Gollum. Right, to make sure that doesn't happen again, I'm going to put keep inventory on. That'll be pretty helpful so you don't lose your stuff. So yeah, this, this video is not going to be too long, guys. But keep inventory. I will actually cheat just so I can put on keep inventory and then I'll deactivate them. Iron Golem is a hard thing to hit. See how I still have my sword. So now that I killed the Iron Golem, I have a bunch of iron, so now I can easily get some iron tools. You may be, that is the cheats. Well, kind of, but not really. So I'm going to upgrade my stuff to iron. The reason why it's not a cheat is because iron golems spawn near villages. There's a cat. So 
don't question my weird noises, okay? Mm. This is violent, but this is Minecraft. Mm. Mm. If you're wondering why I'm killing them, I'm trying to get some leather. Because I need some armour. Mm. One piece of leather. There's some there are zombies in the water that are called drowned. I don't really need sheets anymore because I've got a bed. Unless Joel joins. But I bet Joel is still asleep. Is he up? <laughs> See how it's getting late. All the villagers will be going to bed. Did you guys see that? No, it was probably just me. I know I can only sleep at night, okay? Just tired. Okay, I should be able to sleep now. Hmm. There's definitely some particles. I'll get a sign. Uh, so yeah, guys, I'm just gonna play. I'm just gonna play for a little bit. I'm gonna go mining and then then I'll be pretty much done. Back off sheep. Horses have leather as well, so if you're really desperate for armor, just kill a couple of horses. And if you if you guys don't like horses getting killed, click off the video. Cats don't, by the way. That should be enough food. I can sprint again. Leather! Thank you. Now, I'm going to go to my first house again. It's bloody well. I could create some leather. I could create a leather helmet or leather boots. I'm going to choose a helmet. Right, now I'm going to try and find a mine shaft. Let's get, let's get my hand it. You can eat beetroots as well. So... Even though I said you should start in the cave, if there, are vill if there is a village nearby, start there. Can you guys see that red thing in the distance? Though, those always red things are mushroom trees. There should be, there might be some mushrooms around them. Also remember in the comment section you can ask me some questions for the next reading your comments. And just to let you know, I don't always read the same person's comment. So if you comment like a hundred things, I'm not going to answer them all.
Okay, that'll be the end of the video. I'll see you in the next Minecraft gameplay. Goodbye.